So a warm welcome to you all. We will be underway very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And here we have Switzerland against France. My name's Peter Drury, and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beckley. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. So the two starting lineups. This guy has got great potential and it's Paul Pogba. Not many players leave Manchester United and become better, but he's one. And not only has he improved his game, he's now one of the very best at what he does. Uh, a truly great midfield talent for me. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Looks to slip it through. This game into life. Tries a through ball, and now the finish! You get that clear. Has a swing at it! Good strike, quite an alarm. And it's Sissoko. Sanya. Pogba. Now it's Sissoko. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Goal! France! And France are in front. Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Well, we've just seen intelligent football from intelligent footballers. That's honed on the training ground and lovely when it comes off on match day. France break the deadlock. Oh, they've done well to take the lead there, but they... There's the end of the first half. Not the most convincing of displays. They could certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence and not rush into mistakes. Popper. Evra. Passes it through, Griezmann. Sanya. Musa Sissoko, chance. Nicely controlled. Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. Well, he knew he needed a better angle to get a shot away, and I suppose at least he showed the best option, just didn't come off. like a good ball through looking to shoot really well taken goal unbelievable right back in it almost no time remaining game still on oh, a goal of real quality he made it look ridiculously easy it's almost a case of, of sacrificing some of the power in favour of getting the technique right and technically, that volley was as good as it comes. That's not an easy skill, we know that by now. That's fantastic.
tries a through ball. Griezmann! Pogba. Pogba. Can he put it away? A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. He's got the ball glued to his feet. Goal! France! And they get themselves in front! Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Yeah, tempted and teased the keeper into thinking he could get to it, but it just eased the way to catch the inside of the post. Dire need of a breakthrough, can they? They've just got to get the ball into the box and hope. There's a pop! Oh, that could cost them. Oh, that's a huge save to pull off there. Those moments can have a big influence on a game too. He's kept them in front. It's all very neat football, but time is against them now and they need to get the ball forward. Now the pass. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? And the referee brings it to a close. Fabulous entertainment, drama in spades, and no one would have argued with a draw, but they have lost it. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? It can be difficult at times playing in front of your own fans if you're not living up to the expectations. And I think with confidence looking a little fragile at the moment, they were playing not to lose more than trying to win, and I think everything was just a letdown because of that. So before we go, many thanks to Jim Beglin for his input, and from us both, good afternoon.